Hey everybody, Budget Collector here. Our brand new NECA Snake Alien a remake from a Kenner line from the 90s if I'm correct. Um, just picked it up. Got it for a great price. It was $19.99 if I remember. And I think it was 20% off. Uh, so it fell right within our budget. Um, so far, I like the outside packaging with the graphics on the front. Classic aliens up top. Flip it around. It shows you all the upcoming and ones that are already out. Alien vs. Predator. Dutch and Lynn 2 pack. Razor Claw Alien. Um, Ambush Predator. Clan Leader Predator. Um, Ripley. A little bit of everything. Down here. Shows you 20th Century Fox. Um, ho hopefully it's zooming in good. And then one more quick look of the front before we dig right inside this. Um, I saw another reviewer do it and I really wanted to get it. So let's hope it looks as good as it did in his video. So in the package comes with of course the figure. Comes with the card. That I already showed you. And it comes with a comic. Um, I'm assuming each... Yep. This is number 9 from Dark Horse Comics. Each one of the figures will come with its own comic. So you buy them all to get the full story. Um, let's see how the art looks. Definitely does not look bad. It's a little small. But it's definitely a nice touch. There it is out of the package. I adjusted out these a little bit and moved the mouth around and bent its towel around to where it'll stand pretty good. Um, let's check the figure in inches from when it's standing securely right at about 8 inches. Um, full length, we'll check that next. So we're going... About 20 inches in length in total so we're talking about a really long figure it does have a bendy wire in its tail so you can get it in all sorts of positions each one of these are articulated you can move them around they bend so you have tons of different poses you could get <clears throat> If you're one of those people who do stop motion photography, I think this would be amazing. With each one of those, you can move them just slightly and really show some great movement. Alright. So, moving right along, we have a swivel joint right here. Then, also, let's see, in the neck. You could go side to side, a little bit down, tiny, tiny bit back. Um, his mandibles go up. His tongue, there we go, shoots out. I don't know if it's really transitioning well. I hope it is. This is really amazing what this thing does. Every bit of this is moving. This thing would look so scary in real life coming at you. You look at all the detail. Look at the top of the head. Definitely one of the better looking aliens I've seen. I do like them normally, but this is just out of the box. Looks so cool. So right there it shows you a, another position. We got him leaning back a little bit with his mandibles open. Plus he has a lower jaw that you can move up and down to get a little more. I'm telling you, our Instagram is going to be filled with pictures of this. I already see it. And definitely make sure you check out our Instagram. A little plug about that. 
So you have like greens, blacks, grays, purples, orange. yeah, orange, ruster, bronze. Definitely looks really good. Um, so you have tons of colors. These are all individual, all the way down, where you get some articulation, just like a snake. I think the original Kenner one was a little different color, and I think the tail was split. I could be incorrect, there's a good chance, but if I'm not, I think it was split. But thank you so much for checking us again. Um, check our Instagram, gonna put some pictures of this, we got other things going up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share the love, man. Budget collector, the collector crew is growing every day. Thank you, everybody. Peace out. Peace. Make sure you watch Endgame a couple times. We need we need that to be crazy numbers. One last thing. Look at that. Now, that would be a pretty cool diorama if I get something set up with a cool background and having a classic alien and a snake alien battling to the death with giant teeth and mandibles and pokey tails who doesn't want to see that